it's time for you to get the game that you want for free. Or at least a dream of it, because there will be mystery and a lot of people are going to think of many games that can be free from Epic, because we got some really big games. Well, wait, Mika, maybe they're new. We're talking about vault yes. games on the Epic Game Store. If you're not new, you know this picture. Yes, if you're you not that new, you know this one. Both is the same. It's the Wolf Mystery Games that's happening in May for one month. We're gonna get four games, four titles. One of them could be trilogy, but four weeks and four mysteries. Probably four of them AAA. We've had a few exceptions, but for the most part, four big games for free. We have a lot of fun on this channel, guessing about the clues, making a list for the possibilities for each week, and then revealing the game that everyone gets for free and some very exciting things. The very first vault game, Nikhil, yeah. was GTA 5. Yeah, it's never gonna go as big than Probably not. each year. It's going a little it, bit it, smaller, it but we get surprises. Yes. Yeah. And uh, this is the first year, but just last year we got these four games, so maybe a similar shabby. idea of some of those could I mean, be correct. Death Stranding, Payday 2 Death was Stranding, brand yeah. new, like this, yeah, this, this is pretty, pretty good stuff. So, there's going to be four games, and each one of us mm -hmm. thought of four games. Mm -hmm. So let's start me telling you, I really think LEGO 2K Drive might be it. Tell it me is why. on Epic. It, mm -hmm. It's $30, so it fits. It's nice, nice. Maybe nice. not good, the AAA, good but haul. it's only one year old, and it will be almost exactly one year. On a birthday. On a birthday. If it's the first yeah. fall game. Look, very mixed reviews. And the most important, it's from 2K. We got so many games from 2K and usually during vault games. Usually yeah, in the vaults. Yeah. I think every vault yeah. there has been one game yeah. published by 2K. Yeah. And it was free on PlayStation Plus. It's on Game Pass right now. Okay, so it's already free everywhere. Yeah. So <laughs> might as well take a check from Epic Games to make it yeah. free there. Make sense? So Chivalry 2 is my first choice. This was actually, it started as an Epic exclusive. It is no longer exclusive and Epic often does this. If, as soon as it yeah. starts being sold on Steam, then they say, okay, well, let's give it away and undercut the Steam sales a little bit. That's the part of their business strategy. Um, this was also free, it's free right now on Prime mm -hmm. Gaming yeah. as we record this in April. And also it's, it's an online, like Battle Royale game. It needs new players to keep coming in. And since it's been out for a couple of years now, they might not be having enough players. What do you do to get more players? You make it free. Free weekends. There they did been... so many free weekends. Yeah. But it seems like so many free weekends, it maybe isn't working as well. So make it free to keep on the Epic Game Store. Makes a lot of sense. Pretty decent game too. And we get very similar game, Mord Howe. Yeah. yeah. From Epic as well. Yeah. Or how about Wolfenstein, because hmm. we actually got Wolfenstein doing world games yep. two years ago, and two of them the are one. still yeah. missing. The new order we got, mm -hmm. but the new Colossus is missing. Mm -hmm. It's from 2017. It's not on Epic currently. Not on Epic. But I think more likely Youngblood, even mm. though it's newer, yeah. because it's got very mixed reviews. Mm. And that's that's about it. But as that's what works, we got so many games yeah. from them. Like all, almost usually happens almost doing everything. Yeah. We'll we'll come back to Bethesda in just a minute here, actually. So my second choice, we got also quite a few Warhammer 40k yeah, games. Actually. At least two or three. I think yeah. three that we've gotten. Free, we got Gladius. War, we got Total War. Warhammer, Warhammer one. And more, more, more. Uh, yeah. So. It seems like it seems possible that one of these games in this series will be free. And Dark Tide is just two years old. Again, it has mixed reviews. It probably hasn't been selling very well. And it's an online game. Again, yeah, they need is, they yeah. need players. Yeah. So seems like a good candidate to be a free vault game. Mm -hmm. Or how about Hello Neighbor 2? Hello Neighbor. I don't know if you remember, but back in 2019, Ooh. we got Hello Neighbor 1. We were so young. So that is the first reason. Mm -hmm. And this game is now two years old, okay. almost. Mostly positive reviews. And it was actually on PlayStation Plus March 2024. Okay. So just recently. Mm -hmm. Well, Star Wars. Let's what? talk Which about one? Star Wars. We got already Battlefront 2. Yep. We got, we got Star Squadrons. Wars Squadrons. We got. Didn't we get a Lego Star Wars? 
Not no, yet. we got Lego Batman. Yeah. But Lego Star Wars could be, but more likely, I think, is Jedi... Star Wars Outlaws! No. Jedi Fallen Order. But because of Star Wars Outlaws is yeah. coming, maybe they want to support the big hype yeah. of... And Je uh, Star Wars... Fallen Out Order. Star yeah. Wars Outlaws actually is not going to be on Steam. It's only no. going to be on Ubisoft and Epic. Yes. So they might want to get the Star Wars hype going. Jedi um, Survivor is probably a bit too new, but getting mm, players yeah. who haven't bought into the series into Fallen Order and then yeah. into Survivor and then maybe into Outlaws seems like a good business strategy. And it's a really solid game that I think, even though it's five years old now, it mm -hmm. would get people excited yeah. as a vault game. Another game that would get some people excited is SnowRunner. Mm -hmm. We got Mod Runner from Epic. Mm -hmm. Expeditions just released. Uh, quite mixed reviews, actually. Oh. And SnowRunner is from 2021. It's got so many DLCs. Whoa. You have no idea how many. Yeah. Let me show you. 35 DLCs. <laughs> so if Epic is going to give us free the standard game, that can continue selling the DLCs like crazy. This is actually so one, it's a good strategy. one of the more requested games to go free yeah. on our channel. It goes GTA 5, Subnautica, and SnowRunner is what yeah. people are often requesting. Yeah. So and now that we know that Expedition is not so great, mm -hmm. they might want to try yeah. to get people excited about the series again. Yeah. So Epic, give the people what they want. Or Deathloop. Um, this is one of those games, a uh, sh kind of shorter experience from mm -hmm. Bethesda again. Uh, we got Ghostwire Tokyo a while ago. Ba we got everything. Basically from Bethesda, everything but everything. Elder Scrolls, Fallout games, Dishonored. E Evil Within, Rage. Dishonored, Prey, everything. Rage 2, like all, all, of, all of the things. Uh, Doom, Doom 64 we've gotten. So... If there's going to be a Bethesda Everything. game, there's not that many options left, and Deathloop <laughs> has been free also on um, Amazon Prime. Amazon Prime, yeah, from Amazon Prime. December 2023. Look at you being so well researched. Like he's got all. I so, have it in front of my. De <laughs> De Deathloop seems like a really good candidate for the yeah. for the vault games. So this is all our guesses. I think this time we have at least. At least one. I think I would, I would say two. I'm going to say at least one. one of them. Each one. Each one of us. Yeah. You think? yeah, yeah. But maybe you have better ideas. Tell so us. Tell us. And in the comments. Try to tell us not only the title, but why. Yeah. Because we did some research. You do yours. And then look through the comments. And besides your comment, choose the one that you think is the most logical and put a like on it. We're going to see which comment from all of you yeah. gets the most likes. And if it actually holds up to the vault games, join us when the and vault games start in the middle Caleb, of May. Caleb, I need to stop you because we haven't said... Uh, the most important thing at the very end. Oh. When is it going to start? I was just gonna. I was just saying that, May? like at the May? middle of May. But when exactly? We oh, can do actually we... check Wait, because Mika, it's gonna start do on we know Thursday. Exactly. We don't know exactly, but based on previous uh, ones, 23rd. it could be 16 on 23rd. 16th or 23rd. Yeah, yeah. So join us on May 16th or before. We're here every Actually, week. Actually, we're going to see it one week before. So yeah. maybe maybe even May 9th or 16th. Mm. We're going to see the next game is not visible, but Mr. I think on the 16th is when they're going to announce it. Okay. But you can be with us every week. We live stream about the free weekly games that are announced one week in advance. Normally before you the mystery game You should be with us right now because you just lost two AAA games. You have still chance of Ghost Runner. But least. last week, uh, Outer Worlds and Thief were free to claim for yeah. a week right now. You can still get Ghost Runner. We have reviews for all of these. So come along for the ride. It's going to be a lot of fun fifth year that we're doing this and we're yeah. going to be just as hyped. Okay, let's get the best games we can or dream about them. See you. Bye. Bye.